Activists are frustrated they have not yet been able to stand with a teenager who was shot by police. 18 year old Marcus Fisher was supposed to go before a judge today, but he's still in the hospital. Two police officers shot the teenager last week while questioning him about an armed robbery. They say Fisher started stabbing himself and walked toward them with a knife. While activists question why his court date changed, the county attorney's office says there's an innocent explanation. 18 year old Marcus Fisher was scheduled to appear in court Tuesday afternoon. But when the judge said the hearing had been postponed, protesters went across the street to the county attorney's office. We need to quit this run around with the courts. We need to know when he's really appearing so those who care about him can really be here. If we knew, we would. I have actually had people ask me from the media, is he going to appear today? And I have to tell them, I don't know. We want you to do the work to find out and we want you to know. We don't have control over that. Investigators say on December 13th, Fisher robbed a man of his gun and then shot him at point blank range in the chest. He's facing several charges, including first degree assault and robbery. A spokesman for the county attorney's office said it's ultimately up to doctors to decide when Fisher is well enough to stand before a judge. He's had multiple surgeries. He's been on a respirator. He hasn't been able to talk. He's barely been awake. Friends say Fisher's dad has only been able to visit his son twice in the hospital. Bob Kroll is the head of the police union. He says video captured in the interrogation room shows that the officer's actions were actually heroic and may have saved Fisher's life. Three officers are on leave. That's standard when police use deadly force.